You know, I ran into a guy yesterday in Keflavik Airport. It's a nice guy. He was on honeymoon. He was like, yo, are you Gotham Chess? I was like, yeah, man. He was like, oh, you taught me chess, man. I'm, I'm really into it. And I was like, oh, that's so, that's so nice to hear. And then he goes, dude, uh, I want to congratulate you, man. I saw the video where you became a GM. And I was like, oh. 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 The worst part is I didn't even tell him. I didn't even tell him. You know, sometimes clickbait... Clickbait backfires, man. <clears throat> sometimes it backfires. Like, I was at a kid's event. This kid goes... Hey, remember when you got the black eye because the subscriber punched you because of Guess the Elo? And I was like, oh. Oh. No. Young man, that didn't really happen. No. <laughs> All right, my opponent is not making a move and this might still be a YouTube clip so I gotta be funny I gotta say some funny stuff uh woogly woogly oh he played e4 okay let's play Sicilian defense even though we don't know how to play this opening knight f3 knight c6 cd Rosalimo, because this is the only opening people play now I'm gonna take with the b pawn or we won't take it all that's what Nepo played against me um I mean this is not the move but I used it to beat Nepo, so how bad can it be, right? Nepo didn't even know what to do. So. <coughs> if this person knows what to do, but Nepo didn't even know what to do, I mean, what does that say, right? What, is, what does that say about these... Framnik's onto something. No, no, I'm just, I'm just joshing. Um, I don't think Bishop G5 was correct, because now I cover this, I pressure this, I pressure that. G6 is, is generally wrong because of the structural weaknesses of Black's position, but for Blitz, I really like this approach. I took a look at it after I used it to beat Nepo, and I was like, you know, this is, like, not that stupid. Um, I'm going to take with this pawn. It's kind of edgy. Taking with the B pawn was also fine, but I, I like the immediate, the immediate pressure on the center. Uh... I have a lot of good plans. This is this is definitely not bad. Now the bishop just has to leave. And I just have two bishops. I mean, I just have a bishop pair and good position. I'm just gonna crawl out, push up, touch the shoulder, push up, touch the shoulder, push up, touch the knee, sorry. Uh, here and here and here. And we're chilling, we got two bishops. It's literally the, it's the, the whole position for black. Two bishops, I'm vibing. We're here. Also kind of interesting. C5. But slowly improving. Slowly improving. Not nothing special yet. Nothing nothing crazy has happened. Uh I can go here and then there, but I don't. I don't know how good that is. I could just do this. I don't I don't know if I'm scared of that move, to be honest. I just like my, I just like the position, you know, like I don't have to do anything crazy. I'm just going to bring my pieces to the center because that's, yeah, but that doesn't do a thing. I mean, that's just like, that's nonsense. Um, hey. play an end game. You can also play f5. That might be a bit, we have, we have two bishops, right? So opening, opening the position can't be bad. It can't be bad. F5 looks smart. Now, am I smart enough to take with the knight? Like, is that the best move? Because it looks smart, but it looks better to just keep my structure together and not weaken anything. Like, this game, I feel like I'm playing a decent game. I mean, the other games, I, I was, I felt like I was playing like a moron. I don't think... Uh, yeah, I think this is all good. I think I'm just gonna do this, because I don't want a weakness. There's definitely nothing wrong with taking with the pawn and just putting the king right here and, and like, 
Yeah, we just have long range pieces doing long range things. Knight d5. Also, I can go here to damage the pawn structure. But I don't see a, like I think the bishop supersedes the pawn structure. I don't think it makes sense to play that move. Okay, improve the position of the king and defend everything. Maybe the rooks off the board will will be an improvement for me. Okay, uh, knight here to then put the knight there. H four was pretty smart. Nice attempt at creating dynamics. Okay, we play bishop e four because I said so, and I think that's a good move. Now we go here, so I kinda kinda like where this is headed. I kinda like where all this is headed. Oh. Um <clears throat> I need to make a couple of good moves here, and I think my opponent will just lose. I just need to find where the good moves are. I don't know if that was one of them, but I like that it kinda baits this. This looks like a problem. And after this, I'm just gonna come back. Then the only question is, is there queen g3? Take, take. Okay, I can win a pawn. Take, 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 knight f4. But is that is that what we're trying to do? Are we trying to win a pawn here? Is that good enough? It looks good enough. I'm going to go for it. Looks good. I mean, it looks good enough. I mean, I'm a pawn up, right? Pawn up, a minute up. I got to be cooking. Queen h4. Two pawns up and still cooking. Mm-hmm. Queen a4, by the way, is up another pawn. But are we crazy? Uh-huh. And now, very simple. Check. And back to d8. Ooh. Queen f7. And then queen b8, queen e5. Look at this. Good defense right here by Mr. Gotham. Look at that. That's good defense. And, uh... Check. I can probably just go here, but I, th I, think, I think this is probably good. I don't see it. Now counterattack. Boom! Boom! GG's. That is GG's. That was a nice win! Who do we beat? 92% with the Cecil. Nice. Sicilian is a, is a fun opening. Yeah, see, games like that make me think that's what should happen every game. And then I, like, lose to 2400s. <laughs> like, I feel like that game I just played, like, the, the, the bar, like, the graph, the game review graph looks like this. Looks like this. And just straight down. Like, just totally outplayed. And just, yeah, g6 is not the best move, but then we just play, like, dc was the best move. This was all good, good, good. Good. Okay, rook d8 is... Uh, oh, f5 right away is even better. That's pretty funny. Wow. Okay, f5. Normal. Okay, knight d5 is... Oh, g5. I mean, g5 is a little bit too much. And then uh, maneuvered, 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 knight h5, picked up a pawn, picked up another pawn. Yeah, I just, like, completely obliterated this person. Like, I... You know? I just... I'm chilling, bro. I'm chilling. Just a mad nice game, you know? Just a mad nice little game. No, whoever you played on StarCraft is not me. I don't I don't play anything except chess.